Hello everybody, this is Zaxter99. want to go ahead and show you guys something here. About a year ago, I think it was late January of last year, a game went into early access that actually looked really, really cool. And I was pretty pumped about it about a week or two before it came out uh, when I saw it as an upcoming early release title. It's called Down to One. And I did make a video about it. Uh, sounded really, really cool. 42 players start, only one survives, and pits online players against each other. Uh, later, they added this shield around the area so that people couldn't just hide or whatever or hide out from everybody, and it kind of forced everybody into a central area as the game went on. And basically, only one person's going to win. Everybody else dies. So really, really cool concept for a game. And evidently, I think I read or, or something like that, that this game was made by like a 15, 16 year old kid by himself. So pretty amazing for that. However, I'll go ahead and have the link down for my original video when the game first launched on that first day in beta. Uh, I kind of made an amusing video about it. Uh, I'll put the link down that for that below. But this game was $14.99 in American money ever since it came out last January. Well, even though it has mixed reviews right now, look what they've done to the price, guys. They've marked the regular price down to $0.99 cents and a 40% discount where you can get this game for just $0.59 cents right now uh, until January the 30th, until the end of the month. So a great deal. If you guys like survival games, if you guys like shooter games, even though this game has a few bugs and stuff like that, this game's still quite a bit of damn fun uh, right now. I just played it the other day, and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys exactly how it works right now and the improve, some of the improvements they've actually made uh, in the game over the past year. Now, this game is still in early access. No, it's not. So it is actually a full release now. So we're going to go ahead and jump into this game and show you how cool this game actually is right now. But main thing, I just want to go ahead and show you guys just a minute of this game and uh, kind of how it works and let you guys know that this game is totally worth your 59 cents. Uh, especially if you like survival, you know, online shooter kind of games. Uh, it's not perfect, and I think that's why they marked it down to less than a dollar. But, I mean, the game has got all the settings you want. It's got, uh, if we go into settings, come on, there we go. I mean, you got all these different basic settings you get all these different video settings audio controls so you can you know customize your controls however you want so we're going to go ahead and go back here though and we're going to go ahead and go to play and when you go to play you have to actually hit refresh servers or no servers will actually pop up so because of the sale, these servers are getting full again. Now, before the sale, I just played this game just like two or three days ago, and it was still $14.99. And the servers had, one of them had like nine people on it, and all the rest were like one or two or zero. Now you can see that the servers are starting to fill up, and it means competition. So that is awesome. Let's go ahead and show you how this works now. Now, another big problem this game had last year when it first released, and this was a concern I had even before the game released. Before the game launched in early access, I remember asking the developer, how is he gonna you know have 42 people because he's, it started with a starting room where 42 people would have to sign in everybody had to wait until the game you know until a server had 42 people and then finally it would launch and everybody would run out of the gate and go fight each other and i had a concern there i was like you know what waiting for 42 people even in a big game like call of duty uh can be time consuming uh what are you going to do to you know and the developer seemed to have no problem like uh, they was confident that this game would always get 42 people no matter what and you know the wait time wouldn't be long at all Well, it turned out I was right and within a couple of days after launch people were waiting like ridiculous amounts of time to get into a game Well, they've done fixed that So I joined a server with 39 people what will happen now is when I join it'll just sign me in in a random location I Believe that's how it works. Like I say I only played it like one game the other day uh, just to check it out but i am honestly surprised that this game has dropped to less than a dollar because it's actually pretty damn cool for even for 14.99 i remember my son was actually thinking about buying the game uh for 14.99 a couple of days ago and now okay 
we are watching we are watching another game so when you join and the game's still going what's going to happen is you are actually just going to be a spectator and if you want to change who you're spectating you just hit the e key and uh you'll actually be watching a new character don't know it shows you the location of where they're at up in the upper left but i don't know that it shows you who it is oh yeah spectating right there uh serialist black hit e again spectating so the game's in the middle of the game obviously it's not going to throw you into a middle of a game once it's already started and people are trying to get down to one character because then the game may never end so that makes sense so if you just wait it shows you there's 12 players left 11 players left and uh, finally tells me the round has started spectating but I mean the graphics are really really nice I mean there's just a few little bugs you got a little bit of lag here and there uh, your game your guys kind of run like they're constipated but for less than a buck, man, a lot of you guys, a lot of you guys that follow me on YouTube, whatever, uh, you know, you guys that love Rust and and uh, Hurt World and all those survival kind of games, you're going to love this game. So if you haven't picked it up, now's the time. If you've never heard of it, give them your 59 cents and go play it. Uh, if you play the game for 20 minutes, you get your money's worth, I'm just saying. So... <laughs> Now we're spectating somebody else. I mean, I, I enjoy just watching these guys duke it out. 11 people are still left. I mean, you can see the dust blowing across the land. For this game to be made, if that's true, this kit game was made by a 16-year-old kid. That's pretty damn amazing. Somebody says, why does this game run like crap? Somebody says, to be honest, the graphics are not as bad as I... I thought. Yeah, I mean, you can't go too wrong for 65 cents, guys. Or 59 cents, whatever. Ten players left. I played a game over the other day, and I went in and played, and I actually won. I was only going against, like, I think, 14 people. I actually won the game. I don't know how. I only killed, like, two people, but somehow I ended up winning. Uh, because you got to survive, too. Like, you got to get food and stuff like that. Like, you see up in the upper right-hand corner, you have thirst and hunger and health. So if you can't find food and water or Gatorade or whatever that are kind of randomly scattered about, uh, you'll die. You'll start taking hit health damage and you'll die. Kind of like rust or whatever. So I think the, the only reason I won is because I killed a couple of players early on, but then I was just looking for other players for like the rest of the game and I couldn't find anybody. And I don't know if they were hiding or what, but they just, I guess, all died of hunger or something. I don't know. It just says the perish. When somebody dies, it says perished. So we're down to eight players now. And I mean, if nothing else, even if you don't want to play, this game's worth the money to just go in and, you know, watch these guys fight it out. Pretty cool. But I'm not going to go even and jump into this game. You guys can go play it yourself. I mean, take a chance. Give the, give the developer, give the 16-year-old kid, 17-year-old kid, however old he is, whoever it is. I don't care if it's 30, 30 guys that are in their adults. I don't know who developed this game. That's just what I heard. It's probably true. Uh, that it's just a te one teenage kid that made this game. But uh, anyway, 59 cents right now in American currency on Steam right now, guys. And at least the game actually launched. I, I just have a video, put up a video. I paid $3.99 for a game that won't even download. So uh, this game's a pretty good deal in comparison. want to go and thank you guys for watching. Be sure you comment down below. This has been Zax 99 and we'll see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.